Hello, YouTube viewers. Thank you for joining my Earth Cooking Adventures. Today, I will be making a simple Earth dish. It's called Jello, and to this we will be adding an Earth fruit and vegetable known as a strawberry. I'm looking forward to tasting them. They're claimed to be delicious. Before this recipe, of course, we will have to boil water. And we will be adding an ingredient called Jello, which is the same name as the dish. This is a powdered substance. We can keep, I can clearly feel the powder within it. It contains sugars, which are also contained in the strawberry. And then it contains a particularly interesting substance, which is derived from the bones of animals. I find it difficult to conceive of boiling bones and making them into a delicious, refreshing dessert, as is claimed for the jello. However, I'm willing to give it a try. While we are waiting for the water to come to a boil, I will slice the vegetables. I should say, I believe these are called fruit. And apparently, the green is not one something that one would want to consume. With the slicing done, I'm prepared to try one of these. That is quite good. It has a sweet, a sweet flavor, along with some sour notes, and it's quite good. It has a very good texture. I'm looking forward to seeing of this refreshing earth dish and how it will taste. Now that our water is boiling, we can prepare the first step of the jello. And for that, according to the instructions, we will add the contents of this package to the boiling water while stirring. Ooh, it boils. They cut the package said to make sure that it was thoroughly dissolved. This looks thoroughly dissolved. There's some stickiness. Apparently this material is sticky. Okay. The, 
stretches along to further say, do this to add one equal cup of, or equal amount of water. We started with one cup, as was directed. And to this we'll add a cup of warm, or not warm, uh, cold or room temperature water. From here, we will allow it to cool, and then we will put it into a serving dish because it was required that it be refrigerated. Now that this has cooled, we will assemble it into a container. I'll put some of the strawberry into the container, approximately half of what I've chopped. You know, I will put it all in there. These are quite delicious. Oops, it's built up. I must be more careful. Here's all the fruit. It did not say to add a lot of fruit or make it solid. So from here, this will go into uh, storage, such as a refrigerator. It must not be allowed to freeze, but it must be very cold. I have taken the jello that I freeze previously refrigerated and cooled. And I have put it on a plate so that I can try this. It appears to be jiggly, a gelatinous kind of texture. That is quite good. The fruit, the strawberry, goes quite well with the bone juice or the bone gelatin. The bone gelatin is quite good in and of itself. It's cool, it's refreshing, and it is sweet. Thank you for joining my Earth Cooking Adventures. I look forward to learning about more Earth Cuisine, especially what they call dessert or snacks. This is quite unusual, but it is made from fruit and the bones of animals. Thank you.